name is Daryl Leach. I'm currently the CFO and treasurer for Eris Magnetics, and uh, I've been in the role for about eight months now. I was happy to take the phone call initially for nothing else other than uh, to see what kind of opportunities existed beyond where I was currently looking. One aspect that stood out to me the most was how thorough the team was. They were very intent on making sure that there was a good fit, not just from a skill set standpoint, but from a cultural standpoint. They made sure there was a great technical fit and a really great cultural fit at the same time uh, to ensure that everyone was going to be happy. Having someone act as a facilitator was invaluable. Someone at the table who understood both sides, the senior leadership team at Erie's, in addition to me and what it was I was looking for, made the process go extremely smoothly. I had a sounding board that I could use after interviews to help me prepare for the next round. Uh, and more importantly, I had a resource that I could go to to actually prepare me for the initial round of interviews and every interview afterwards. It's the first time I've ever experienced anything like that but I can say with uh, a lot of confidence and certainty that for me at least it's benchmark type performance it's the right way to do it it's as close to stress-free an interview process as you could have usually the most stressful part of any kind of uh, onboarding is the actual negotiation itself uh, but because there were benchmarks available Everyone understood exactly what it was I was looking for. Everyone understood what the company was looking for. The facilitation process made it easy. My negotiations were limited to a couple of phone calls and yeses or nos. Having someone involved that takes the stress away from the most stressful portion of uh, a new opportunity was invaluable. So they made sure my values aligned with the company's values. They made sure that the fit from a technical standpoint was there and that they handled the tough conversations. The check-in points were a wonderful addition and not something that I'm used to seeing. Uh, I appreciated that because there was a familiarity with everyone who was sitting in on a conversation uh, that a lot of things got accomplished, less from a technical standpoint, more from a cultural fit, the values fit, uh, and comfortability. Uh, I appreciated that there were anywhere from three to four people on the call at any point in time, and the only intent was to make sure I was taken care of. The depth of the conversation definitely made the onboarding process easier, uh, but from a comfort standpoint, made it clear that uh, Decision Associates and Aries Magnetics were very serious about making sure that uh, I was given every opportunity to succeed. There was never a point in time where I felt like I couldn't get in touch with someone about an important topic if I had an issue. The level of responsiveness was almost immediate, which is not something that you find, and the thoughtfulness. Again, I go back to the onboarding process. I go back to the, uh, the focus on the, the cultural fit in addition to the technical fit the professionalism with which everything was handled from the, the initial contact to the final interview to the onboarding to the negotiations. Um, thoughtful, caring, professional, those would be the three words that come to mind. To any leader considering using Decision Associates, I would say the onus is on you to make sure that you're very clear on what it is and who it is you're looking for. And I have very little doubt that Decision Associates will find the right candidate. It's not just about the technical fit. Technical ability is really easy to find. Finding a good cultural fit is a lot harder. Not using them, I would offer up, put you at a disadvantage. They're a very thorough company and they do it the right way.